Hi guys, welcome back. So today's video is my, what month was it? April? April BoxyCharm unboxing. <laughs> I always, I never know what month it is, let's be real. Like it just flies by, how the frig is it already April? Today I'm gonna be unboxing my BoxyCharm and I am giving away two things. So of course the first thing that I see in the box is their little card that comes every month. And this month is a little bit different. It comes in like a trifold type of situation instead of just like one card. It shows the pictures just a little bit better, gives a description and the prices. So I don't think much has changed. But it's just a little bit different and then the coupons are on the back instead of like on a separate little card. So this month you can get 10% off orders on Tarte.com using code APRILBOXY from the 15th through May 15th. The first thing in the box is this. This is a Dr. Brandt Vacuum Cleaner Pore Refining Mask. I actually love Dr. Brandt. I've tried out a few of their things in the past, especially with BoxyCharm. So I just love that they give a very nice high-end brand of like skincare in the box. It says it's supposed to unclog and tighten the look of pores and reducing excess oil from the skin's surface. And it retails for $47. That's a lot of money for a mask. So we're going to test this out. It says on the back you're supposed to apply a thin layer to areas of concern, avoid eyes, leave on for 5 to 10 minutes until dry. A cooling sensation will occur, so that's good that they warn you. Rinse with warm water and pat dry. Use 2 to 3 times per week for maximum results. So, but there are a little bit of beads in it and it is clear. So let's put this on. It says there is going to be a cooling sensation. So, I'm just going to apply this mask in my T-zone because I don't really get pores on the perimeter of my face. So, I'm just going to apply it right in the center of my face. I don't know. It just feels really good on the skin. I feel like it's actually doing something. You know what I mean? When masks, like, you can tell that they're doing something on your skin. I don't know. You can feel it. And I actually really like that. So, I'm going to leave this on for, like, 5 to 10 minutes, go wash it off, and then let you guys know how my skin feels after. So I'm back and I absolutely love this mask. My skin feels so clean and so smooth. Oh my goodness. Even like right in here where I have a lot of pores, it feels very smooth. But totally worth it. It's amazing. I didn't really have to use that much either. So I feel like this is going to last me a good amount of time. So the next thing that I see in the BoxyCharm is this. This is the Tarte Pro Glow Liquid Highlighter. This is in the shade Stunner. So I actually have the baby version so I am going to be giving away this one so I am going to be giving this away I haven't even opened it haven't even touched it I just took it out of the packaging so stay tuned till the end of the video to figure out how you can win this so yeah I thought why not just give back to my followers I mean I love you guys so might as well just use the mini one since I don't really use it anyways but I'm just gonna dip my sponge into it and then apply it right on the top of my cheekbones honestly a gorgeous highlighter I just I don't know I'm more of a wow that's a lot I'm more of a powder highlighter type of girl hey Alexa play that funky music here's a statement for funky music funky soul classics from Amazon music Honestly, just wear this um, highlighter alone without any foundation. It's so stunning. All right, so I am back. And the next thing in the box is the Brow Gel, the Instant Light Hair 03 Tinted Brow Gel with Microfibers. And this retails for... $22. So this is pretty much a brow gel with microfibers in it. It looks a little light for my brows. Oh yeah, that's a little nerve-wracking. I just want to see what color it is. So that's the color. It kind of looks like an ashy taupe. I'm going to try it. It does have little fibers in it, so I guess it's supposed to make your brows look more natural and full. I don't really... 
Huh. I don't really see any like highlights or anything in my brows. They kind of just look m more put together, settled into place, not so insane and crazy. I actually really like this. The next product is the My Little Pony in ColourPop Eyeshadow Palette. So this comes with pressed powders and the packaging looks like this. Um, I'm not really a big fan of packaging like this. I'm more of like a sleek type of packaging girl. I don't really like, you know what I mean, like cartoons and stuff. I don't know. But I mean, I get it. It's My Little Pony, so it kind of suits it. And then the names of these shadows are on the back. And this is what they look like. I'm going to be honest with you guys. I really don't use any colors like this. I probably will use like this shimmer, this shimmer, maybe that color. And I don't really tend to go towards like colorful eyeshadows. I'm more of like a nude tone type of girl. So, um, I don't know. I kind of want to give this away as well. Is that bad? <laughs> I know this is like a testing out video, but... I just know I'm not going to use this. I think instead of using this and wasting it, um, I'm going to give this away. But I am going to be able to test it out because my mother has BoxyCharm as well and she got the same exact palette. So I'm going to go grab hers and I'm going to give this away to you guys too. So there's going to be two winners. There's going to be one winner for the Pro Glow and then one winner for this palette. So stay tuned. There's only one more item to test out. Let me go grab her palette so I can give this away to you guys. Didn't even swatch it, didn't even touch it. So I'll be right back. So my mom actually did not get the same palette, but she did get like a ColourPop collab. So I got the My Little Pony and she got the Element of Surprise. But I mean, pretty much I just want to test out the shadows, see if they're good, if they're worth it. You know what I mean? So I am going to be still giving this away just because I know I'm not going to use it. So I want to give it to someone that's actually going to use it. Shade and this is Go With The Flow. <laughs> that's a cute name. Wow, that is gorgeous. I actually really like their shadows. It's so effortless. And the payoff of the color is there. So that's the first shade, and that again is Go With The Flow. Very easy to blend out. I'm actually very sad that I didn't get this palette because I would actually use it. Peace of Mind, and this is a dark burgundy purple shade. And this is in the shade Fleas, and it has like a little reflection of purple on it. I think I'm going to use my finger for this because I just feel like shimmers look way better with your finger. And then on top of that, I'm going to go in with Rayon because this is a little bit lighter. I was expecting that shimmer to be a little bit lighter than that. So let's see if we can lighten this up just a little bit. And these are what the eyes look like. I actually really enjoy this palette. Even though I only used uh, four shades, actually, out of the 12, I'm definitely impressed. I like this a lot better. Even though I don't go with pink eyeshadow, I totally think it's worth it. And it retails for $16, so it's really affordable. And if you're looking for a new affordable palette, to kind of play around with then I would definitely check this one out. So the last item in this month's box is this Adesse High Definition Liquid Lipstick and what is shade is this? What shade is this? It does not say. It retails for $24 so it is a higher price point and on the packaging it says it's a luxurious creamy long wearing liquid lipstick formulated with vitamin c and e moisturizes and hydrates the lips while providing the full coverage of a lipstick with the ease of a wand application the gorgeous color love it very nude mauve love the shade but as you can see it's very shiny it's like a gloss pretty much so i'm gonna put a liquid lipstick on my lips right now because I don't have any lip liners to go under this because the wand is very 
flexible as well like you can see that it's so flexible I would not be able to get like a clean line with this so I'm gonna go in with a nude liquid lipstick first and then I'll put that over top of it I'm gonna go in with a low key in the Tardist lip paint so now I'm gonna add the Adas one on top So I would say that this is more of a gloss and I would use it as a gloss instead of a liquid lipstick just because it's very hard to get like a very defined line without a lip liner underneath it because the wand is so flexible. But this is the color of it. I absolutely love it. And it does have like a candy scent to it. So and it's not too overpowering where like it's annoying your nose. But it is very nice. It's a little bit sticky. But... It's not the worst. So, to win the Tardis Pro Glow Liquid Highlighter in the shade Stunner or the My Little Pony in ColourPop Shadow Palette. So, you have to be subscribed to my channel and you have to hit that little notification bell next to it. Give this video a like and comment down below what you want to see on my channel next. Maybe like more makeup videos, maybe foundation reviews, maybe more fashion hauls, more vlogs. Just let me know what you want to see down below. So good luck and I hope you win. So the total of this month's box is $138. That is so much. Girl. And there were a lot of good products. Very impressed with this month's boxy charm. I hope you guys are too. Really enjoyed a lot of the products. And don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell. Give this video a like. Comment down below for a chance to win these products. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye loves.